Hello guys, one more week together and today I'd like to talk with you about Let us see His glory. Let's read 2 Corinthians chapter 3, verse 18. We all with unveiled face, beholding the glory of the Lord, are being transformed into the same image from one degree of glory to another. Whoa, what a calling we have in Christ Jesus. You know, what was the most loving thing Jesus could do for us? May I ask you, what was the end point, the highest good of the gospel? Redemption, forgiveness, justification, reconciliation, sanctification, adoption. We could go on and on. Well, are not all of this simply means to something greater, to something final, hallelujah, something actually that Jesus asked his Father to give to us. If you remember, he prayed in John 17, Father, I desire that they also may be with me to see my glory that you have given me. Oh, what an invitation. The Christian gospel is the gospel of the glory of Christ. Because its final aim is that we would see and Savior and show the glory of Jesus. When the light of the gospel shines in our hearts, it is the light of the knowledge of the glory of God in the face of Jesus. Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. In one sense, Christ laid the glory of God aside when He came to save us. But in another sense, Christ manifested the glory of God in His coming. Whoa! Whoa! Therefore, in the Gospel, we see and save the glory of God in the face of Jesus. Amen. Let us see His glory and be changed into His image day by day in our Christian journey. Be blessed.